Hi guys, I'm Danny Rahim. I play Mac Rendell on Primeval New World, and this is episode five. In Ep 5, I had to fight an imaginary dinosaur when I'm in the shower. And it's always interesting fighting something that's not there because you want to play it truthfully or with integrity. So with that in mind, in 5, I knew that it was slightly shorter than me. I knew it was quite fast, quite vicious. Because obviously, if it is a T-Rex or something that's humongous, you, you probably wouldn't challenge it. So you have to gauge how would you then react to something that's twice the size of you. It wouldn't necessarily be a head-on impact. You might find a way to sneak around it and get its legs. And you know, you find different ways of trying to fight something that's imaginary, ultimately. When we got through the physical size and, and aspects of the creature, then we work on how we're going to tackle it and how this fight's going to take place. And so, so for this particular scene, it was me being in a shower and hearing a growl and I turn around to see this dinosaur and then I grab a fire extinguisher and I hit. It's all timing, you know, and size. So you've got to sort of, as you hit it, you've got to gauge, well, it's going to have a tail, it's going to have a swing round, something's going to move and you, you've got to make sure that you're playing the, the length of the dinosaur, the size of the dinosaur, all these aspects, because otherwise it's not going to be believable, it's not going to be credible. Mike Roll was the particular director on that episode and he was very thorough and very rigorous in, you know, let's get this right, let's make sure we, we, we play it so it looks like you're hitting a real dinosaur. You want to play it truthfully or as truthfully as you can without it actually being there. So you've got all these things going on in your head but, but at the same time you just sort of try and live the moment and use your imagination to create this dinosaur, to create the feel of that impact, how would that then, how would my hand then fly off, how would I then move afterwards, you know. So it's a lot to put together, but you just, you just get on with it. <laughs> you just do it. 